Hey YouTube, Silver Hair Stacker. Well, I just couldn't let this one go. Um, and by that I mean I was looking at YouTube videos this morning and I saw where Silverfish VT has decided he will not make any more silver videos. And that was, I mean, that kind of came down as a shocker to me. Uh, however you feel about the guy, um, I, I don't know. I just couldn't let it go. So here I am doing a little video about it. Uh, I originally started to make just a video and I'll go ahead and put that up at the end of this one. Um, what, what are your thoughts about it? Um, you know, how many, let me ask you a question. How many uh, of you out there know of a person who's done videos, has a YouTube video channel, and has had a bigger influence, or is more popular uh, than Silverfish VT? I mean... There's lots of good stackers out there to follow and keep up with and watch and get encouraged by, like Big Stack McGee, uh, Salivate Metal, Mr. Vegeta, Silver Siren, uh, 24K, um, I mean, even Mikey, and uh, I'm telling you, you know, there's, there's lots of good uh, videos and, and encouraging people out there to look at and see who to kind of emulate but um, I don't know of anybody that's had more influence possibly in the last two years than Silverfish VT um, anyway just throwing it out there and tagging this onto the beginning of my regular uh, showing of what I've been picking up and I put out some some silver eye candy just just as a backdrop but I don't know what do you think uh, some of y'all probably going oh listen to silver hair he just crying over the loss of his little buddy mr. silverfish and oh you know he's just a whiny butt eh, and I don't care what you think but uh, I think it's gonna be a big loss um, I enjoyed Silverfish's uh, videos, and I didn't really care what he put out there, but he always made sense, and most of the stuff he was saying, so I kind of leave it at that. Um, tell me what you think below. Uh, am I just a goofy uh, old man? <laughs> I probably am. Um, but anyway, tell me what you think. Uh, I'm going to miss Silverfish's videos. So, uh, this is your Silver Hair Stacker saying good luck. God bless. Hey, YouTube. Haven't done a video in a while, so I thought I'd show my recent pickups. I haven't done a video in a while because I haven't had, gotten all that much stuff lately. But anyway, uh, here's what I got. This is the... Rwanda Buffalo. It's a pretty cool coin. I'm kind of liking these. I like the way they're sealed. Um, they are kind of meant to be kept in the original packaging because they'll probably be worth more that way. So you don't really have to buy a uh, a um, what do you call it? Airtight for them. So, those are neat. I picked up six of those. And, these are the proof coins. The 2014 Year of the Horse from the Royal Mint. Mr. Vegeta put us onto these coins, and then the ones he got in had spots on them. Now, I can't see any spots with my naked eye. I got out the 15 power loop, and I still couldn't tell 
if it was just the dust on the case or and then I took them out of the case and I I still didn't really see any problems with mine so I kept mine uh, I got four of those they're pretty cool coins they come in a nice case and they got the the brochure with them and I think they're numbered yeah I got it got a COA here yeah so this is coin 3896 and very cool all these coins are one ounces you also get a little what's it what you might call it card with it it's basically I don't know what it's for it's like an envelope with a card in it I guess if you wanted to give it as a gift you could use this to write write something to whoever you gave it to anyway lunar year of the horse I really like these they're beautiful coins and I'm sorry if anybody got spotted ones mine seemed to be okay so I'm gonna keep them anyway that's all I got uh, appreciate you watching this is your silver hair stacker and we'll see you later bye